what is up i am back i am playing tiny rogues today so this game a just released last week i really want to try it out it was on sale for like four dollars and i bought it i had money on my steam account i was like hey it's a cheap game i'm going to just buy it and hey let, let's see how it is I really like the art style of this game and feel of the game. Fire is strength. You need to start a fire. All right. So fire is strength. And I like the CRT vibe that the lines are going down the screen and stuff. That's really cool. I really, really, really like that. Bring back more souls. So there's out of game progression. Hardcore mode, defeat, death five times to unlock, disable all effects from passive blessings. Select a class, the hero, a hot blooded young hero on a quest to vanquish humanity's biggest er adversary can they defeat death grant a red dice any time you enter a new floor start with a random weapon from the tutorial after completing it all right so i'm the hero all right, let's see how this goes. Welcome, young traveler. I am here to help you get going on your journey. Sp uh, space or E slash E to continue. So we'll do space. Uh, ASW. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can only dash with space. Well, dashing, you are invisible, invincible to enemies' attacks. Dash costs one stamina. All right, see that. You can... Splendid. Now attack the target dummy with the left mouse click. Yeah, yeah. Attack, 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 attack. Attack that dummy. Let's go. Hi, you are a natural. Let's meet in the next room. To defeat stronger foes, you will have to arm yourself. Press E or spacebar to continue. Pick up items with E. Open your inventory with F. Okay, so this is my inventory and drag the item or left right click the weapon to equip it you see took the item can i just take all of them i could take all of them f uh you know what i want to go with a wooden sword Handy tip, if you want to know more details about your equipment or compare items, hold left shift. All right. A range. Okay. If you want to... Something about G. Shoot. Time for a real battle. Next room we'll do that. Okay. I died. Death claims another. Wow, I like that animation. That was fast. I died. Alright, whatever. The pit. Welcome, young traveler. Yeah, 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 yeah,
I didn't complete the tutorial. Press Q for other later. You're a natural. Let's continue on to the next room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to take all these weapons. And then I'm going to open up my inventory and I will actually equip this weapon. Or details with equipment or you know even about current you can go character panel was C. Okay. So it wasn't G, it was C. Time for a real battle. It will start next turn. General offense. Yeah, that's a lot of details. Oh, I'm, I have the bow equipped. When did I equip the bow? I thought I equipped this. Apprentice is one. Alright. Well done. Now bear with me for a moment. Press E. On your journey, you can find... You will sometimes find... These things. Press E. Or spacebar. Pairs increase your dexterity. Meat increases your strength. Candy increases your intelligence. Okay. Food items increase these. Will level you up and increase your power. Weapon damage scales with your attributes. Additionally, attributes from le uh, level ups give you health, stamina, and mana at 10, 20, and 30 points. So, don't neglect attribute points that don't directly benefit your weapon. That is all I can teach you for now. The rest is will you will figure out on your own. Alright. Grab the strength one. Probably want to switch to a sword after this room. Alright. Switch to the sword, and then they give you an option between a vent or a grant bombs. A vent. Press E to interact. Here's the resting place a once powerful hero. Alright. They found value to progress the innocent. To protect the innocent. Hearing about the hero legacy fills you with determination. Okay. I got soul heart now. Let's go with me. Ooh. Alright. Let's go. Ah, screw you. Meat. Grant a key. Grant's dexterity. I don't know what the key does, but... Probably want to get one of those.
All right, let's kill those. Let's go. And... Grants a key. Grants a small amount of gold. Probably gold's good. All right, got some gold. Uh, let's increase my intelligence. All right. Increase my intelligence. Plus one to all stats. Heck yeah. Time to feast. Ooh, I think there's a boss. Yep. Well, I just got wrecked. Because I only had one life. Want any tips? Uh, sure. Are these okay? When entering a room, deal two percent more damage per level for five seconds. No, deal two and dis increase additional damage per level. Check your buffs in the UI. Yes. I have no idea what that means. But sure. Uh, I'm sorry. Buffs. Probably in game you're talking about, right? You can read about them when the character panel is open in game. Okay. Deal to increase physical damage per level. The thing you got from reading gave you a permanent permanent buff. From reading? The status with the flowers? Hmm. Okay. Uh. Gifts. Statue. Uh, collections. Complete the tutorial. Complete guess. Class win zero. Yeah, uh, I will probably have to go in game. Figure out what you're talking about. But, yeah, uh... Is it this that you're talking about? The fortune favor? Or... Something? I'm sorry. I'm just not following. No, only in game. Okay. Alright, let me do these upgrades then. Uh, well, that one costs 250. Uh, all these cost 250. Okay, I only can do one then. Increase damage over time. Yes, uh, let's go with that. If in your last playthrough you read some stuff in front of a statue, it gave you a buff that you didn't realize. Maybe? Yeah, probably did. Here, let me see. Character screen. Uh, intelligence, stamina, recovery. Miscellaneous. Movement speed. No buffs yet. Yes, buffs will show up when it's open. No buffs yet. Okay. I understand. Let's go here. Let's go do this. Kill this little bat. Kill that. And... 
kill that room. Uh, drop loot when scattered. All right, I'll take that. All right, killed that. What is this? Can I not break that? What's the use for that? Uh, yeah. Confused about that. Gotta bomb it? Dang it. I have zero bomb. Alright, now I know. So it's like Isaac that you have to bomb, like, stone type thing. Okay, I understand that. I follow, I follow that. Let's go for a key. All right, intelligence or gold. I'll go for intelligence, a little up more. All right, that's the first item that I've gotten. Contains a shrine, okay. percent damage dealt power shrine okay so now i do 20 percent more damage cool cool and probably should switch to the staff very little health now all right let's press f Oh, I do not have a staff. Okay, well. Uh, look at buffs. Gain a new trick. And damage per mana. Defense. Miscellaneous. Total damage. Magic damage. Where does that 20% come into play? It's that big thing on the middle of the screen. Oh, it's right here. 20% more damage dealt. Four rooms. Oh, for only four rooms. Okay. All right, let's go for the stake then. All right, I died. Yeah, that sucks. Eh, that's okay. Chuck it up to being tired. <laughs> anything don't want to get spoiled anything? Uh, just want to know the UI to learn it. Haha. <laughs> I, I, I just want to figure out pretty much. Honestly, I was figure out from basically for myself, most of the stuff, but Uh, eventually over time, it, it, right now it's just really, I'm learning how to play the game and that's actually fine. That's really what I'm trying to do right now, but down the road, I might learn, look up stuff or do stuff and learn more about how the game to actually play the game. But right now I actually just want to pretty much play. So I need a bomb to break that. That sucks.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see you hitting, trying to hit me with your stupid attacks. Wow. Oh, I was in the circle. All right, more damage. Uh, tavern. Sit, stay, and have a drink. Or get another heart. Okay, press E. Welcome. Can I help you... Get a beer? Okay. Yep, don't have enough gold. Okay. Yeah, 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 whatever. Interact. Tip for drinks. One... The maximum amount of tips... Yes, you can endure is determined by your total amount of hearts. Okay. If you want a drink, you'll have to talk to the tavern keeper. He's the only one in charge of our fine ale. All right. A real soldier always brings some replenish powder. In battle, want to buy some? Let's say five gold. I don't have any gold, so no. Hello there. My father was a gambling addict. May he rest in peace. He left me the farm in a really bad condition. He always left me his dice collection. He also left me his dice collection. Would you be interested in playing a red dice for... Buying a red dice for 10 gold? Yeah, but I don't have any money. Alright, so the tavern gives you a lot of stuff, but... I don't have any stuff, money to buy any drinks or anything. The beer is good, hmm? Can't bring it into battle, though. Are you sure interested in any alternative? I'll sell you some sake for 10 gold. Understandable. After all, you aren't a cool samurai warrior like me. <laughs> all right. Eh. All right, that's fine. Got some stuff and I'll go for a bomb, I guess. All right, so those get knocked out whenever they do the dash and then hit a wall. Alright, got some bombs now. We'll go to get some gold, too, when I'm at it. And got some gold. I have eight gold now. Okay. Intelligence. Okay, yeah, I'll go for intelligence. I want to level up. Contains simple rewards, not locked. Okay. So a chest. I got a chest full of rewards, but they're not locked. Press E. Okay. Plus one key. Okay. Was that the greatest thing ever? No. Grants a random melee weapon. Hmm. Grants a big amount of gold. Ooh. Both of these are elite, so it looks like. Nothing can stop me. Minotaur. Alright. Well, I have to figure out the attack pattern. Alright, well. I understand the attack pattern now, but... Man, you don't have a lot of life in this game at all. Well, probably is a meta progression thing to increase life. Like, what is this? Reduce price of items at the shop. 
Uh, no, this. Yeah, it grants one soul. That's 2,000, though. Wow. All right. I don't have any souls. Okay. Start with 20 gold. Gold bar. All right. So there's a lot of out of game progression. That's cool. All right. Let's go increase grants a small amount of gold or intelligence. Let's go for intelligence. Oh, I have a staff now. So it's a random weapon you start with. Okay. Understandable. Understandable. Makes it more of a roguelike too. That, well, it is a roguelike because these rooms are random. Well, it's a rogue light because there's auto game progression, but yeah, just <laughs> I only saying that because I played one game that said it was a rogue like, and I'm I question if it was a rogue like. Uh, I'll open that and get yeah, meat. I want to level up some. So that's what the keys are for. Alright. Uh, small amount or bomb. Bomb, we'll go for a bomb. Go for a bomb. It's amazing game. Uh... I heard that this game is amazing. That's why I really wanted to play it. I just never got around to it until actually today, sadly. Uh, Crants a bomb for one. I'm about to level up. Yeah, I probably like the staff more. Probably because the range on this staff is a lot better than the range on um, the melee weapon. The sword. Alright, so this is the level up animation. Okay, level up. Choose one. Reduce one heart of room completion if you have taken damage in that room. Recover one heart. Okay. If I took damage, so I have to take damage to recover hearts. But if I take damage, then I recover one heart. That's a pretty good ability. Recover one stamina on hit. I'm going for that. Because I'm more destined to actually take damage. All right, kill that. Now, how do I use the bomb? Is it G? Was that the G button thing? Uh, A, Q. Did I take a heart damage? I was standing right there. <laughs> it's Q. <laughs> I think I took some damage there. Damage. Grants bombs. Grants intelligence. Let's go for intelligence, I guess. Yes. Yes, yes. Intelligence is where it's at. It's a lot more, or less K 
chaotic than the last game I was playing. Try your luck at the arcade. I have a key, but I don't have any gold, so that would probably be pointless to go in there. Alright. I gotta kill you. I gotta kill you. Come on. Stop moving around. Alright. Yeah, I see you over there. Alright. Grants a random accessory. Grants a random body armor. Uh, Body armor. Oh, the Minotaur. Okay, I fought this one before. Like, understand the attack pattern somewhat. Alright. Yeah, I need to stay away from it. It's a range fight, pretty much. Pretty much, if I stand in the middle, like right here, I'm pretty good. Alright. Yeah. Alright, that was easy. Alright. <laughs> Completed that Minotaur fight. Finally, and got some souls for that, too. Alright. Press E to go to the next floor. So I completed that floor. Now we go on to the second floor. Huh. Interact. Tips for adventurers. 7 out of 10. Did you know purple projectiles will curse you? No, I did not know that. Also, green projectiles will off inflict poison. Grants a random consumable that is not a potion or influences effects. Oh. It's like a skeleton that in this bone pile thing over here that's throwing a bunch of like bone things at me. All right. Blacksmith Heartstone. Upgrade random upgrade weapon by one level. Ooh. Upgrade a weapon by one level. Upgrade to level three. Work click to consume. Reroll room reward choices. No, I, I don't need to use that. Lock chest that contains stuff for melee fighters. I'm not currently melee fighter. Fully refills health. All right. So, yep. Uh, we're using one of these dice. Grants a medium amount of gold. All right, I'll take that. Ah, screw you, skeletons. All right, got it. All right, contains weapons. Grants a melee, grants a medium. All right, let's go for the weapons. Oh, I got pistol, revolver. All right. Leaf one. Magic elemental slash. Physical trust, thrust. 
I have a ton of intelligence, so probably the leaf one would be the best to take. So... Wait. How do I see again? <laughs> I forgot again. Right clip to quit. Alright, I'll just equip the this. This does more damage though. But it costs more at APS. D D Huh. Alright. Ooh, I like that. I gotta close that inventory. Alright, that's F. Okay. So I press that. Contain simple rewards, not luck. Alright, I didn't take any damage in that corner. Ah, oh, sweet. Let's go. Alright, let's open that. Uh, yeah. This room is closed. Upgrade weapons and repairs armor. Alright. Let's go do that. And... 20 gold. Need anything forge? Talk. Don't get yourself killed upgrading a weapon. Increase its damage. Alright, so do I take damage from upgrading weapons? Or is that just repairing my... That's just repairing it. Okay. So we'll do that. I enhance the weapon. Thank you for the trade. Ho ho ho. Are you Santa or something? <laughs> What? Alright. Yeah, blue heart. And locked chest that contains valuables of rewards, grants a random consumable that not a potion or influences effects. Okay. Let's go. Unlock that. And I got a bunch of gold. I got 10. Not bunch. Got a shop. Alright. Grants three random rewards. Grants a random shrine effect on consume. Grants plus one dexterity and plus one intelligence. So I only can afford this. So I'll grab that. And right click to consume. And character sheet. Recover one HP on room completion. So yeah, that was the thing for getting leveled up. Grants a random accessory. Alright, we'll go for the random accessory this time. Who dares to enter my lair? I do. It's a leech. Oh, screw you. My blue heart. No, my blue heart. 
Those suck to dodge. Oh, and you send out little skull things to come after me. Yeah, I see. Oh. Ah, oh, I didn't do the dodge. Ah, oh, I died. All right. Well, that sucked. Has this already been 40 minutes? Wow. This is a fun game. All right. So I can buy more characters. All right. So night. Uh, you deal 5% more damage per armor you have. Find an additional random consumable on boss room completion. 20% more melee attack speed. Grants a soul heart when you enter a new floor. Ooh. Thank you very much. Let's grab that character. I will definitely take that character. Interact with this. This is a tip for adventurers. 9 out of 10. Did you know most enemies and even bosses have a weakness to a damage type? Knowing weakness can be handy when possessing possession of influencing consumables. No, I did not know that, but that's nice to know. Will it be handy to know that? Maybe, maybe not. I want to just level up, so I'm going straight for intelligence right now. I want to get that thing that if you get hit, you get your hearts back again, too. Uh, Vent. Let's go for gold. Uh, intelligence. Let's go. Alright. Intelligence. Not locked. Chess. Yeah, I'll go for that. Oh, it's a mimic. It's a mimic. Kill it. Kill the mimic. All right, got a bunch of gold. Uh, no, let's go for the key. I will go for the heart. The soul heart, to be exact. And got it. Contains a shrine. Let's go for the shrine. Ooh, this room has some, like, poison. Oh, shoot. I took some damage there. That sucked. 20% more damage dealt. Okay. Open that chest. Got another key. And I'll go for armor. Oh, spider. Time to feast. Alright. Is that all you're doing? You're walking towards me and then... Oh, nope. You went up in there. Okay, and then you slam on the ground. And probably I can get stuck in your webs, probably. Too, so I need to avoid that. All right.
All right. All right, killed you. Got ya. Thanks for the souls. Maiden dress. Recover one heart on room completion if you have taken damage in that room. Sweet. I got the thing. Got the maiden's dress. Let's go. Alright, grant a random influent effect item. Gains intelligence. I'll gain intelligence. Why not? Fudge. Oh, I have the dash. I, I forget about that. Alright. Plus two mana gain... 30% more attack speed with magic weapons. Four seconds when you pick up a magic mana star. Stop mana duration when you attack at full mana. Discharge all mana to deal massive area damage. Okay. I died. Ah! All right. Good game so far, but man, I died a lot. All right. Let's level up this. Reduce pierce of items. Shop. Deal 20% men... Damage per level against undead enemies. I'm going to actually swap out back to the hero. And... I will go with... Increase duration of shrine effects by run room. Slow mana duration. No. Increase stamina. Increase the effect of potions. When you enter a room, deal 2% more damage per level for 5 seconds. Where are the gifts? Accessory that grants an additional heart. Ooh, nice. Starts with five bombs. Only someone with a wish for death could complete using complete compete using this. All right. Start with twenty gold. All right. Well, in inventory you will find boss rooms. One room earlier. Okay. Well, in inventory, you will find boss rooms. One room. Oh, I already read that. Why am I reading that again? All right. Lao's reroll trait selection once. Okay. Yeah. Starts with keys. And then this one. Consumable that spawns a mana start star every four seconds for 10 rooms. Fully recover health and curse potion once can't be used in combat. Summon a storm that damages enemies for a short duration. Consumable that influ influences weapons with infuses weapons with poison for 10 rooms. Consumable that repairs all armor. Mount 2. I will go with... Well, I can't afford any of these. Except for this one. So I'll go with that one. Because that's not bad to have an extra heart, too. <laughs> I got bow this time. Let's go for dexterity. Oh, 
Ooh, the bow has a lot of range. Dexterity, let's go. Alright, there, there's a little room on the side right there. Open with one key. Okay. So there can be rooms on the sides. Okay, interesting. Alright, one key, intelligence. I'm just trying to level up right now. Plus a soul heart. I think there's a boss room coming up. Nope. Alright. Dexterity. Alright. Gotta kill this one. Alright. Killed it. And level it up. Okay. Let's, uh... Pick... 25%. Percent more damage when fighting exactly one enemy. Mm. Crit hit chance. Oh, that's pretty good. Alright, yeah. Crit hit chance. We'll go with that. I don't have any bombs, so that's not going to help me. And I want some gold. I'll get some bombs now. I will place the bomb and get a stake. Increase my strength. And I will go for armor. Minotaur, sweet. All right. All right, I got this. We got this. I was in the range. That's okay. Ask. That's okay. Got some souls. Let's go. Collect that. Whatever. I don't really care. I'm going to collect it anyways. It doesn't really matter what it does. It only matters when I get another one. I don't have to sw uh, maybe swap it out or not. Alright. I'll go shrink. Whoa. Alright. Those little triangle pyramid things suck. Alright. Hoping for some healing. Grants a random consumable. Ah. Uh. All right. I always forget there's a dodge ability. Consumable. Displaces curses. I don't have any curses, so... 
guess that doesn't help me too much right now. Like, probably can down the road if I live, as per se. Alright. Consumable raises your level by one. Alright, so I'm almost at the next level. So I'm not probably going to use that consumable yet. Throwing stars. Kunai. Alright. Sickle. Physical thrust or magic. Staff. Prime weapon. It's just a regular staff. Throwing range. Inflicts armor break. Press E to pick up. E to pick up. This has the most amount of range. So I will open this and how much range does this have? No, yeah, this has more. Ooh, I like this. Tavern, yeah, no, the tavern won't probably be worth it right now. Oh, it's hard to see the what they're doing it's hard to see what they're doing when you're shooting all right i need another i need to level up just keep moving got this and i leveled up sweet Agility, increased movement speed, uh, 25% more damage to enemies at far range. Infuse effect. Infusion effects are permanent. Raises your level by one. Displaces curses. So I don't get to choose, though. That sucks. Oh! When you increase your level to one, it gives you one XP. Okay, I get it now. I'm learning. And I'm using the dash more now, too. Uh, I'll go for some boots. Press space. You won't get the better of me this time. I almost died. But I ran into it. I'll do one more run. And now I can buy another thing. When you enter a room, deal two damage. No. Alright, we'll do that. Boom, boom, boom. Fun little game. Oh, I got a staff this time. 
Uh, let's go for the chest. Ooh, what's this little creature? Ooh, where are you? All right. Are you like a... Gr no, it's not a griffin. I got some bombs. Let's go for intelligent. I'll go for shrink. They don't need the bomb, so right now, at least. More intelligence. All right. Drops. Uh, yeah, I'll go for this. Let's kill these little slime guys. Little slimes. Let's go. Alright. Grab that. Load up. Sweet. Alright. Uh 50% increased damage bonus from mana. Okay. 25% increase attack speed. I do like attack speed. Invade the first damaging hit you take in every room. Oh, yeah. Wow. All right. Man, I can take more hits now. I can take a hit in a room without actually losing any health. Sweet. And if I could get the thing that actually makes it for you recover health at the end of a room if you take damage, then I can actually pretty much take two hits without having to worry. Alright, let's go for bombs. Got some bats and spiders. Little thing. All right, uh, grants a random magic weapon. Plus one to all stats. Probably want plus one to all stats. All right, spider. I know how you play, spider. All right, going to do the slam down a move right now. Invaded! I invaded! Sweet! I've never seen that pop up yet. Alright. Alright, we got this. Killed it. Let's go. Got some souls and plus one to all stats. Sweet. All right, let's go. Yeah, this game's a really good game. Not as chaotic as the, like I said, the last game I played, but it's a fun game. And it's very relaxing music. I really like that. Like 8-bit music. Ooh, that's a big radius that thing can do. Oh, it's on their death. 
Okay. Let's go for intelligence. Lock chest that can contain a value. All right, I'll go for the lock chest. All right, you just have to pay attention to where I'm going. All right, got it. Minus one chest, and I got a bunch of gold. Okay, sweet. Grants a random potion, but I'm going for this. What's this? Spell book. Magic. Range is 150. This is 170. Arrows always pierce. I don't know what the spell book does, so I want to see. Alright, I have to equip it first, though. Alright, I see, I see. Recover 1 HP. I already have full HP. That won't do anything for me. And I looked down for a second, and I evaded the attack. It was coming at me somehow magically. I don't know. <laughs> Infuses weapon with gold for one ten room or cold, cold, not gold. Yeah, I, I wouldn't know why it would infuse it with gold, but yeah, <laughs> cold. I must say, lock chest that contains stuff for magic users. I don't have any keys, so that wouldn't really do me any good. Alright. Intelligence? Uh, I'm almost leveled up, so intelligence is probably the best choice to go for. Yeah, I like the spell book. Alright. Grants 30% more attack speed with magic weapons. Four seconds when you pick up a mana star. Plus one to intelligence proficiency. Plus 100% oriental... Hit multiplier. Huh. Grants a random potion. Yeah, I like this spell book. Definitely like this spell book. This is my vibe. Increase movement speed by 20%. Grants immunity to being slowed for five rooms. Alright. Uh, 25% or 10% chance magic damage, cost 8. Increase magic damage or dispose curses. Grants 250 souls. I don't have enough for that though. Alright. I just infused my weapon with cold, and we'll do that one too. And now we're going into the boss fight. Uh, I'll go for the accessory. Press E. Hopefully this time I can kill this one. You won't get me this time. I said that last time, but this time is it. Third time's the charm. Killed it. Let's go. 
I almost took damage there. Increase range damage. Alright. I'm on the jungle now. Yes, the jungle. Whoa. I'm already getting attacked by a ton of stuff. Tons of plants. Alright, let's see. Lock chest. Grants a key. Grants a key. I don't have any keys currently. Oh, shoot. Those carrots can shoot at you. Alright. Grab the key. And let's go for the consumable. Yeah, stay away from me, carrots. Killed the carrots, and killed that, and I got another red dice. And I'll go for intelligence. I tried shooting the things that the plants are shooting out. Yeah, no, that's not the things. It's not the enemies. Oh, that's like locked door. I didn't even pay attention. I think I took a hit there. I don't know how to destroy those. Can you destroy those? Maybe not. Probably not. Yeah, I can't destroy those sword things. Uh, let's go for the tavern. Oh, Santa! Hello, Santa! Ho, ho, ho! I am real Santa. Can you believe it? Hey, kid. Mind helping Santa out? I'll sell you a gift box for 20 gold. How about no? Uh, yeah. That's disappearing to hear. Disappointing. Depressing to hear. Depressing. Hmm. Do you want to buy this storm in a bottle? Whoa, that's way too expensive. No. Buy a beer. Yes, let's drink. Buy a beer? Heck yeah, we're buying one. Alright, I have two beers now. I think I'm good. Good and tipsy. Let's go. And no, I don't have a chip. I don't have a key, so. Going for that would be pointless, actually. Alright, killed everything. Let's go. And I'll go for a key. Alright. Killed everything. Wait, did I not grab the key from last time? Or did I... I don't know. Ah, whatever. Medium gold chest. Yeah, we'll go for that. Or maybe misspoke. Grants a random magic weapon. Okay, well, I'll go. I'll get that. You disturb nature's peace. I will stop you. All right, what's your special gimmick? You do these spin attack things that stay on the board for a heck of long. And then you do a line. Alright. Oh, and you have red ability. 
thing, red circle things too. Oh, the invade is you invade evade the first hit that you take. Ah, oh, so that's what that is. Ah. All right, now you're actually shooting red stuff at me while you shoot the other thing. And now you just up the bullets. It's ridiculous now, this fight. I just need to kill this to get the souls. Please, just don't die. Alright, killed it. Let's go. Alright, I'll take that. And I'll equip that. Ooh, man, that was a little bit stressful. Fully recover health. Okay, yes. But there's a bunch of enemies in here, so I have to actually kill these before I fully heal up. Die! Come on. Oh, when they die, they actually are exploding. Well, can't make the healing room too easy. No. Alright, heal it up. Nice. Cover one heart. Why? I just got a healing room. <laughs> Ooh, there's a ghost that does a dash now in this area. All right, and there's a wizard in the middle. I don't know what the wizard does. Oop, it shoots fireballs. I see that. And those Frankenstein looking things is cat at you and try to hit you. Lock chest that requires you to pay one heart to open. All right, let's just kill everything and we'll open the chest. Uh, plus one key found. Oh, I'll lose one heart when I equip that. Uh, no. Is there a way to recycle these? I kind of like the spell book more, to be honest. So, probably going for that ma magic weapon was not the best. Alright, I can upgrade a weapon. Twenty gold to upgrade my spell book. Sweet. Ho ho ho. Buy items in the shop. Eh, why not? 13 gold. I just have enough. Yeah, let's take that. Thank you very kindly. Grants a random potion. Lock chest that contains multiple potions. 
don't have any keys, so I can't open up a lot chest currently. All right. Increased damage by 20% for five rooms. Inventory is full. My inventory is not full now. And grants a random consumable. All right, we'll go with the random consumable. Yeah, no fire for you, witch. You fade that tack. I took a hit. Grants a random shrine effect on consume. Increased damage for by 24% for five rooms. Okay. I can throw items on the ground. I just throw all of those. I don't really want those right now. Anyways. So. That's fine. Alright, leveled up. Come on, healing, healing, healing thing. Plus two hearts. Heck yeah, let's go with that. Grants a random a fuse effect item. All right. Infused weapon with fire for 10 rooms. Well, I'm going to go and equip that right now. I think that's more damage. So go check my character. Yeah, more movement speed. All right, that's the shrine effect I got. Random magic weapon or a random accessory. I don't think either of these I really care about, but I'll go for the magic or the random weapon. Vampire. All right, what's your gimmick? All right, you shoot like a bunch of purple things and bunch of red stuff. Okay. I see. And you just hit me. Dang it. And you turn into a bat. And send out bat. Little bats at me. Red little bats. Be exact. And purple ones too that go really slowly. Oh, this is great. I have the dash. I never really use dashes and these types of game that much. Alright, killed it. Let's go. And I didn't take any other damage than that first damage. So I didn't lose any hearts. Um... How's that good? I'll equip in, see what it does. It only does like 50 to 70 damage. Class C. No, this spell book's class A. I'm not gonna take that. Intelligence or a bomb? Intelligence. Oop. You're trying to do the same thing I'm doing? No. That's a bad, bad, bad enemy. And the snakes are leaving a trail of bullet behind them. 
scorpion. I see what the scorpion does. Yeah. All right. Interesting. I just evaded. Man, I took a hit already. All right. Uh, give a key. Grants a key. Yeah, I'll grant. I've got a key. All right, I got two keys. Nice. Uh, I don't have any money for that, so I'm going for the shrine. And these skeletons are sending out purple stuff that are moving extremely slowly. And my weapon shoots purple too, so it's really hard to tell where the stuff is. So it's great. Faster stamina, recovery speed. All right. Uh, no. Grants more keys. But yeah, I ran into you in the, the first floor. That wasn't that hard. All right, intelligence. Nice. Getting tons of magic. Grants a minor amount of souls. Hmm. I hope in more runs to follow. All right. Yeah. 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 I'm doing really good on this run. But let, let's not jinx myself and not say any more stuff about that. <laughs> Fully recover health or lock chest that contains a rare weapon. I'm going for full health. So I can take as many damage in this room as I want. Well, not as much as I want. But a good amount. All right, fully healed. Don't need bombs, so I have to go for this one. Well, I can re-roll too, but I'm trying to save those for stuff that I want to re-roll. I'm not willing to actually take the thing. A huge amount of souls? Yeah, why not? Let's go. Cycle of life and death. Continue. I will live. You will die. It's immune. I see what you do. I'm just focusing. I'm sorry if I'm not talking that much. I need to take out those chalices. Or those things of fire. The cups of fire. I don't think those chalices per se. Kind of look like chalices. They just keep on spawning back. 
whenever he does that move. That sucks. Think out. All right. Half health for the enemy. Boss. I'm not the most precise, but that's why I like the spell blank so much. I can just fire pretty much in the general's area and do a bunch of damage. I just lost a bunch of max hearts. Dang it. I took so much damage. I was going to say, I thought I was not taking any damage until I took a ton of damage. I was gonna say, wow, I'm not taking any damage. But no, like, I took a ton. Alright, so I'll level up and probably get off of this game. This was fun. Definitely will play this game again. Effects of potions by 5% per level. Alright. Increase effect of potions by 5%. 10% per level to recover 20 hearts when entry a new floor. Alright, I'll, I'll get that. Get that. And I think that... Uh, we'll do that too. Alright. I think that's good. So I'm going to end the video here. If you like this video, like it, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching. Really do appreciate it. If you want to play Tiny Rogues for yourself, there's a link in the description below. And I will see you in the next video. All right. Bye.